Here's the airplane. Bummer. Absolute bummer. Took off too slow. I guess it stalled and just pitched to the left, cartwheeled off, blew everything apart. Absolutely horrible. But, I mean, it survived, and I did too, which is a miracle. So here's, uh, there's the tail. There's the wings, still pouring a little fuel out of it. Uh, nothing to do, except take a look and cry. Yeah, what a drag, all that work, all gone. Oh man. There's that, you can see where it impacted. The wings over here, I hit this bush and then it cartwheeled or that bush and then it hit the prop. Here's one blade of the prop over here. Anyway, that's it. Sad story, bummer. No one's hurt. So, so what happened in the crash? Basically, I put down, I wanted to try and see if the tail skid had worked, so I uh, wanted to give it a big yank on takeoff, so I did it real early at around 28 miles an hour or so, and it went straight on up, and then it had no control. I had full rudder in, I had full right aileron in, and it just kept torque rolling to the uh, left, because the wing really never flew, it was just hanging on the propeller. So then I started pushing the nose down, trying to get it to fly, but it just kept rolling, and it was sending me off the runway at that point. Or, and then I was in a 90 degree bank. At that point, uh, I clipped a creosote bush and it just cartwheeled, and uh, that was the end of that story. Yep. <laughs> but of course, that was never is with Chris. Uh, so shortly after the crash, I decided I'd go in and uh, join up with Chris because he was going to go renovate, essentially, rebuild the airplane. So I joined him on that and helped as much as I could uh, here and there. Uh, he did most of the work, but I put in a few hours. And uh, the next year and a half looked uh, something like this. So the plane came in like this. Cabin frame was damaged, the wings were damaged, the tail as you can see was severely damaged. Left wing was crumpled beyond repair, but the electrical and avionics was almost all intact. So we had to pull out some of the plans, order some parts, take a lot of parts apart, deburr a lot of rivets, but at least we had help.